What's up guys, gals, and non-binary pals? Nears here with uh the zero episode, if you will, of HMR, the Homebrew Movie Red New Podcast. I'm your host, Near Miller, and I am joined by Lewis, also known as Colonel Quirk, the Hispanic Heartthrob. Hello, hello. Ben, also known as Paragon, my brother from another mother. Hello there! General Kenobi, and Tyler, also known as Stylus, the Artistic Anomaly. What's up, gamers? And so, what is the Homebrew Movie Retinue podcast, you may or may not ask to your computer screen looking like a fool? Uh, so, we're basically a, we're going to be just reviewing movies uh, at our own pace, not our own pace, uh, movies of our own choosing, but first, what we're going to be doing for the next who knows how long, every week on Friday, we're going to be reviewing and ranking an MCU movie. And we're going to be reviewing and ranking every movie of the MCU, all the way up until Black Widow, but we're going to, I don't know why I said all the way up to Black Widow, because we're going to do every single MCU movie ever. So once Black Widow comes out, we're, just, we're going to keep going with the Eternals, which releases, well, actually we don't know because of recent events, but... Yeah, including the TV shows. We're going to be uh, ranking and reviewing TV shows, but not on an episode-by-episode basis. We're actually going to be reviewing them. We're going to be reviewing each episode, yes, but we're not going to rank it until all the episodes are finished. Just to, to be a bit fair to... It doesn't it does just, just doesn't make sense to rank an episode. Uh, but we're going to have a little a bit of special segment in there, like chilling with the villains. We're going to be ranking every villain. And, and a bit more. And I'm pretty excited for how this is going to go. Uh, what are everyone's thoughts on this so far? Uh, I was I wanted to ask with TV shows and all. Does that include Cloak and Dagger? No, because it's not a quote-unquote MCU show. Like, it, it's, I, I guess, technically an MCU. I'm not 100% certain. So we're, so we're talking about more like um, Disney Plus MCU stuff. Yes. Or it ties directly to the main. Yes. Movie. Yes. Okay. Because okay. okay. we're not okay. we're not going to be ranking like Agents of Shield because that's one. It's Agents of Shield. Two. There's there's eight seasons, and I I don't like I, I've watched seven of those seasons. I I don't want to rewatch all of those. Not that the show's it's bad. The worst show in the world. It's it, it's just it's very long and it's very tedious. Yeah. Um. There's it's, not really enough time. A hundred percent. So yeah, we're not going to be maybe uh, at the. Um, maybe near the, not the end of, uh, but near, like, the, the later parts of the, the, uh, you know, the, uh, Marvel's retrospective, we're gonna just discuss a little bit our thousand agents of S.H.I.E.L.D., or, not our thoughts, but the people who's watched it, like, those thoughts, because, Ben, you've watched it, haven't you? Yeah, I've watched it. Okay, I so haven't you... seen the most recent season, but I was planning Neither on Neither have I. Uh, yeah, I'm, I don't know, I, I can't even say if I'm planning on watching the most recent season. I... I think the way the season seven ended, or whatever, maybe it's not season seven, but whatever the, the season ended, I think you know what I'm talking about. That 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 ending, I feel is conclusive yeah. e- enough that I don't need it anymore. Like I'm good. Yeah, I'll I'll see how it goes in the future. All right. If we if we don't go over it, it's it's not the worst thing in the world. But if we do, that'd be an interesting episode. Yeah. So. Alongside all of the um, the Marvel films and TV shows, um, we'll also be uh, looking at and discussing, um, not necessarily ranking, uh, more individual films. Um, just of our own choosing. They could be good, they could be bad. We'll see. Yeah, so the, the, the whole MCU re- in, uh, review, you know, a Marvelous retrospective, is not going to be our only retrospective, though. Uh, because, you know, Inevitably, we'll we'll be we'll be caught up with the MCU, and then we'll move on to we'll do four standalone movies, just reviewing them, not ranking them, and then we're going to move on to another retrospective that we're gonna leave we're gonna leave a secret for now. So there's that to look forward to. But yeah, episode one will be tomorrow. Uh, for us, it's 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 a Friday. 
where we're going to be reviewing and ranking Iron Man. Well, I say ranking, we're just going to be reviewing Iron Man because this is the first movie of the MCU. You know, obviously we're not going to rank it. Well, we're we're going to rank it, but you know, we we know where it's going to later fall. Yeah. later on later on later yeah. On. yeah. So, uh, have we all seen all the MC, MCU movies? Yes, I, I mean, I have. I have, I have. I also have. I'm I'm trying to think of if there's any that I haven't. You've seen all of them. Actually, oh, yeah, you've seen all. Of them. Nope, I have never seen Captain America: The Winter Soldier. Never seen The Winter Soldier. Yeah, I've never seen The Winter it's Soldier. Amazing! All right. Wow! Well, I, we, now, now, now's your chance. I'm, I'm, actually, yeah, I'm looking, looking back. I'm honestly shocked. Well, actually, I should be shocked that I haven't seen The Winter Soldier because Captain America hasn't been my thing. But I don't. This retrospective might change my mind. So. Maybe Winter Soldier will affect my opinions on Civil War. I'm not going to say what my opinion on Civil War is, but I do have opinions on Civil War. And maybe Winter Soldier will change that. So, yeah, I think Winter Soldier is the only one that I haven't seen. I'm trying to think. Uh, most of them I've seen a couple of times. There are some, like, Thor Dark World I've only seen once. Uh, I've seen all of them at least, at least twice. Like, I've seen Guardians of the Galaxy 2 twice. Um, but I think I've seen the rest of them, uh, more than that. My, my most watched MC movie, I think, is Spider-Man Homecoming. Uh, and, and Guardians, Guardians and Spider-Man Homecoming are ones I frequently come back to. Um, so yeah, I'm excited to see, because I have, some of these I haven't seen and, uh, haven't, like, actually put attention to seeing in a long time. So I'm really excited for... Uh, if my opinions could change, because my opinions could very well change, especially looking at the MCU as a whole. Um, what I think is my number one now could very well change. I, I'm I'm open for it to change. So that also how we're gonna our voting process how it's gonna be is that at the end of the show we're going to be voting after the discussion because uh, of the the film will will. Discuss a starting point for like we automatically think it's better than so and so films, you know. Like, uh, so we'll, we'll start from my sake. We're starting from like a number nine spot. We'll be saying, okay, who thinks it's better than existing number nine? Who thinks it's better than number eight? You know, like everyone raised their hand. Who thinks it's better than number seven? Tyler, Lewis, and Ben raised their hand. Um, so you know, who thinks it's better than you know, so and so? We'll be tweeting it out. So that's how it's going to be. But at the end of this retrospective, we're going to be doing a sort of a marvelous retrospective retrospective where we're going to be giving our own personal lists, overall thoughts on the, the future of the MCU and some more fun things. Uh, so with the, also with the ranking, we're going to have some fun rankings. Like we're going to have chill with the villains, ranking every villain. But we're going to have some more uh, rankings that I will not comment on now. But we may have some more more, more fun stuff to go over. That I'm pretty excited. I think that covers the main... Our, our, the, the main crux of Homebrew Movie Retinue. Anyone else have anything to add? Uh, I'm going to... I'm just really excited to get started. Actually, yeah. Thank you. I think it's important to note that um, when it comes to reviewing the movies, that we won't be reviewing them as um, we won't be reviewing these movies in um, relation to the future films. We'll yes. mostly be uh, reviewing them in relation to the past film. Yeah. Uh, like for example, we won't be saying does this movie um, until we get to said movie. We won't be saying. Does this movie hold up to Endgame? We'll be saying more like, how does um, the Winter Soldier add on to the lore established in um, the first Avengers? Okay, okay, yeah, yeah, one hundred percent. So we're yeah, we're going to be. I forgot, forgot to mention that. Thank you. I, I forgot to. Yeah, we're going to one hundred percent avoid future spoilers, um, because it's it's not fair to the movies to compare them to movies that haven't happened yet. Compare. Like, 
you know what I'm talking about. Like, again, like Blake said, we're not going to compare Winter Soldier to Endgame. That just doesn't, until we get to Endgame, obviously. So, it just doesn't make sense. It's like for ranking, you know. Uh, so, yeah. That, I think, covers everything, right? I think so. So, uh, where, where can we find you guys? Um, you can find me, Lewis, uh, on YouTube, Colonel Cork, or on Twitter, same handle, Colonel Cork. Uh, I do gaming videos there, and I'm planning on doing some other stuff, but until then, just for gaming. Uh, but yeah, that's, that's for me. You can find me on Instagram, at stylish till 418 I do art, I do Photoshop, I do logos, come find me, I'll find you, I'll hurt you, come to my Instagram. <laughs> oh, <All right. laughs> um, and right now you can't really find me anywhere, I don't have much up uh, in the way of YouTube, and I don't have any public social media, so I'm the ghost of this group here. Uh, and <laughs> for me, uh, you can find me just just anywhere. Uh, YouTube, I am near as here, as you probably know. Uh, and uh, Twitter's Detect Prince Forty Six. Just search Detective Prince Forty Six on on something, a social media, and you'll probably find me. Uh, shoot. Oh, okay. And that reminds me, this podcast will be going up on Podbean, SoundCloud. YouTube, and uh, I'm working on getting it uh, uh, approved. We're not approved, but I'm, I'm working on Spotify. So, how, that's going to be... It's not difficult, but how, how I'm going to do that. Still working on it, but yeah, Spotify is what we're working on, and Apple Music. I'm, I'm, right now, I'm working on every podcast service around the globe. That's my goal, but right now, it's just Podbean... SoundCloud and YouTube are the big ones. Uh, I think right. that covers everything. This has been Sounds the right. Homebrew Movie Retinue. Anyone else have anything to add? I'm good on my end. Okay, I then. I'm also good. Uh, this has been it for HMR. Have a marvelous day.